What's going on my YouTube family? So, little update on my vegetarian way of living. So I've been doing it for about three and a half weeks now. I was only meant to do it for about a week and a, well, about a week, seven days, but we've done three and a half weeks. And um, sadly, today is like basically the last day. Well, not the last day necessarily, don't get me wrong. How have I felt? Well, my skin feels cleaner. I feel like I've lost a lot of weight as well, like, like like stored belly fat and all that kind of stuff. I've lost a lot of weight down, uh, like excess fat on my belly and stuff. Um, I don't feel more energized. Um, I do feel healthy, like I don't blow after meals and stuff, and I don't feel like all groggy and that. Because when I used to eat KFC and stuff like that. Um, or I'd eat, like go and get you know like a, a chicken curry or something like that from a takeaway. I'd feel really groggy after. But what I've found in these three and a half weeks is I feel like quite like I don't have much energy, and you know I feel like I'm not eating the right amounts of nutrients that I need, like zinc and all that kind of stuff, um, and. This is why I've decided to still eat vegetarian. So I'm not gonna eat any beef. Um, I'm not gonna eat any lamb. I'm not gonna go to KFC and eat their chicken. I'm not gonna go to like any other food, fast food restaurants and eat meat because I know that the meat there is obviously disgusting and it's all like processed garbage, you know? All these, you know, like meat that you see getting like thrown about in factories and, and and animals that are like literally like just being cut open and stuff alive and all that kind of stuff and all that halal me where they twist the cow upside down and slice it. I'm not gonna do none of that. I'm not gonna I don't wanna be any like anything to do with any of that. So what I've decided to do is I'm gonna eat fish, still gonna eat my vegetables and all that kind of stuff. But what I've done is I've splashed out a little bit and I found a butcher that does free range chicken. I'm just going to eat chicken because, and I'll tell you why in a minute, but let me show you. So, this small chicken here, this small free range chicken here, normally in Sainsbury's or Tesco's, you're looking at maybe like this would be, this would be about £3, and I paid £10.88. But it's free. It's definitely free range because I went there to their farm where they do it all, um, and I've got some chicken wings as well. As you, as I, you guys know, I'm on a keto diet right now. Well, for those of you that follow me on Twitter, you'll know I'm on a keto diet where I'm not in, eating any carbs. So, can you know the chicken wings? And again, free. This is all free range stuff. So it's really, really good stuff, and it? it's humane as well. Obviously. Obviously they, you know, they have to kill their chickens, but they make it, they do it as quick as possible. And it's a, it's a really nice family butchers as well. And you know, and and like the, the, the butcher himself, his wife is actually vegetarian as well. So, um, got got talking to them and stuff. And and uh, I'm happy with, you know, by spending a little bit extra and getting stuff that's more humane and it hasn't been pumped with loads of steroids and antibiotics and all that crap. So, gonna do that. The reason why I just wanna eat chicken, the reason is because chicken has so many nutrients in it. It has zinc, um, it has good healthy fats, it's got vitamin B, high in B, vitamin B12, B6, vitamin A, vitamin D, the list goes on. There's so many nutrients in chicken and to get it on a vegetarian or a vegan diet is very very hard like okay yeah you can eat fish you know but fish won't have the, uh, the same amount of you know the good the good stuff basically the same amount of sort of minerals and vitamins that you need from a chick you know that you need to live on like mate same amount of nutri nutrients that's the word i'm looking for same amount of nutrients that you need to live on um and in the, so in the chicken there's all these things and to get them on a vegetarian or vegan diet you need to be eating beans, you need to be eating lentils, you need to be eating this fruit, that salad, um, 
taking these seeds and all that kind of stuff and it's very very like like you know don't get me wrong it, that's good you know but it's very very like it's hard to do that especially like if you're a busy person like myself like it's very it's kind of long-winded to do all of that now I'm not making any excuses obviously I should be doing that I should be but it gets very expensive you know and 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 you have to wait around for the food and, and I, I was gonna like just eat oysters because oysters have a high amount of vitamins and stuff but going to look for them and stuff was just a nightmare the other day and I thought you know what I'm just gonna they're, they're animals as well you know so I'm gonna eat chicken free range chicken because it's got all the nutrients I need and I'll be happy with that so I'm still gonna eat vegetarian I'm still gonna eat my, my you know my my salad and my, my lentils beans and all that kind of stuff um, I eat fish but I need to eat some kind of meat because I need the new so, yeah and the chicken is the best one so um, so I'm, I'm doing all right I'm still winning man I'm still winning but you know um, so yeah that's what I'm gonna be doing and the the vegetarian thing is still gonna continue but obviously I need to eat something so chicken but I'm not going out eating processed garbage I'm not going to takeaways and all that crap just free range spend a bit more get something a bit more humane a bit more cleaner a bit more safer it'll be all right but yeah that is my little uh, update and I'll see you guys soon peace